Scandia, one of the most exciting critical minerals, some would argue. Guy, tell us why we should all have scandium at the top of our critical minerals hit list. Scandium, very easy, because it makes very, very specific aluminum scandium alloys. High density, high strength, corrosion resistance. Imagine you can reduce the weight of anything that is moving from a satellite to a boat to a car and reduce it and be as strong. So that's the future. Scandium is the future. And of course, you have a technology application that takes your Scandium to the next level with 3D printing. Can you provide an update? Absolutely. We are in the pre-commercialization of our aluminum Scandium powders, patent pending. And it's a very, very unique. It's an interesting situation where you can print very, very difficult shaped object that cannot be otherwise manufactured uh, the same way. So you are providing the industries with a new possibility of very, very specific parts. And you have a track record of taking exploration plays to production. You personally invested in Scandium Canada. Can you give us an update on how that's going? Well, that's uh, markets, as everybody know, are difficult, but I've been able to attract the First Nation, the Naskapi Nation of Kawawachikamak with us for 5% going ahead in the project. Uh, and I'm personally invested in the, in the project, like you say. We are definitively looking forward to the, the, all of the grants and all of the subsidies and all of the support from the federal and the provincial governments in Canada, Quebec, Newfoundland to be able to support the next phase, which is the pre-feasibility and the feasibility studies. I think the deal you just announced with the Nascapi Nation shows how well you work with the community. Can you tell us a little bit more about that financing, please? <laughs> yeah, we we talked for a while uh, of the possibility for the Nascapi to uh, become a shareholder, get involved uh, closer with the development of the project, uh, not only hear their comment when we go and we present and we meet, but also get them directly involved in the, the decision-making process of how you design a mine, how you put the logistic, how you get the First Nations involved. So instead of only being on the receiving end, be in the team, work with us. And that's how we're able to discuss and come to the conclusion that they should become a shareholder. Initially, 5%, but uh, I'm looking forward to convince them for more. And of course, for everybody out there who would like to learn more about the most exciting hard rock scandium, which is, of course, a critical mineral in the world, please go to the following website. Thank you for the update.